Alan and I spent some time traveling around some of his old haunts of Felixstowe, where he wanted to show off the sorts of locations that have influenced the game's art style and buildings in the game. It seems he went to Australia for a number of years, and when he returned, he was re-inspired by such buildings as Langard Fort. Coming back from Australia in 2019, I was again introduced to all the coastal areas of Suffolk that have inspired the game even when I was in Australia. But being back here to actually come up close to them again was a real treat. Just being able to like take pictures of all the textures and being inspired by the actual constructions themselves. And Langard Fort has a lot to offer. It has definitely pushed a certain particular environment forward a lot more. But that inspiration kind of seeps through into all various different cracks of the modeling process and various different aspects of the design. And uh, Langard Fort has some really interesting contraptions inside as well. And even though I might not understand what they did myself, um, obviously you can learn about them, it's the idea of what they, what, when you incorporate the uh, imagination into what they could do in an alien world, in a fictitious world, that's when you can uh, have some fun as a designer. Langard Fort is a perfect example of Napoleonic and World War II joined together. And you might not see those differences straight away, but when you start looking closer, like you will in Nia, you'll see that there are differences and you learn about those differences as well. 